Super lightweight at just around a pound and a half in the regular size and slightly heavier in the long, the Marmot Atom 40 degree sleeping bag is a great option for those ounce counting, warm weather backpackers and hikers. The bag is filled with a high quality 800 plus fill goose down insulation. That down is treated with Marmot's down defender treatment to enhance the water resistance and wet weather performance. The fabric is an ultralight Pertex Microlight 20D ripstop nylon, and the lining is a slightly more durable 30D ripstop nylon fabric. Smooth, curved baffles reduce the shifting of down, and the Nautilus multi-baffled hood enhances warmth retention up high. Sewn through baffles ensure that the down will not shift from baffle to baffle. The bag is EN tested to perform to a lower limit of around 35 degrees and is comfortable at around 44 degrees Fahrenheit. The bag is accessed through a full length locking YKK two way zipper with a zip guard slider. Behind that is a snagless insulated draft tube for warmth retention. Included are a stuff sack for backpacking and a storage sack for long term storage. Let's take a closer look at the Marmot Atom 40 degree sleeping bag. The first thing that stands out to me with the Marmot Atom sleeping bag is the weight. It is a super lightweight sleeping bag and it is very compressible. With that 40 degree temperature rating, this would be an excellent summer weight sleeping bag and it compresses super small for even those ultra lightweight enthusiasts. The insulation is an 800 plus fill goose down insulation, so it's a super high quality down insulation, and it is treated with Marmot's down defender treatment. What that means is that the down will resist moisture longer than traditional down, it will dry out faster than traditional down should it become wet, and it's going to maintain its loft and insulation if it becomes wet, so it puts it above traditional down in that sense. The materials are super lightweight. We've got a 20D Pertex micro light face fabric, so it's a very soft but very abrasion resistant material and it's gonna pack down very small. The baffles are all sewn through, so the down is going to stay in place and they are smooth and curved, so the shifting of down is gonna be minimized by that. The fit of the bag is a mummy cut, so it is gonna be a little bit more snug but there are some improvements to enhance the room and the comfort in the bag. For example, down in the foot box, we have an anatomically shaped foot box that's fully wrapped and you get insulation all the way around that foot box. So instead of just being sewn top to bottom, it kind of opens up the foot box area to give you more of a trapezoid shape so you've got plenty of space for your feet and they're gonna stay nice and toasty warm. Down at the bottom, we also have some hang tabs. So if you do need to hang the bag to dry it, there's that down there as well. At the top, the shoulders do come out pretty wide, so you do have some pretty good space up here. There are actually two zippers. There's the full length two-way YKK zipper on one side, so you can zip it down from the top to get in or up from the bottom for venting. So that is definitely a nice feature to have. And to increase the ventilation if you need to, there's actually a second zipper on the other side here. So you can open that up, you can open up both zippers and kind of fold down the top of the bag if you want to. So just some added convenience to open up that top of the bag. The hood is that Nautilus multi-baffle hood, so you've got full insulation throughout and you have a draw cord there to cinch it down in the event that it gets a little more chilly throughout the night. There is a small stash pocket on the inside of the sleeping bag. It's very tiny, it's a great place to store maybe some extra chapstick, lip balm, whatever you need there. Really small stash pocket for some extra goods. A really convenient feature about that zipper is the zipper guard and the anti-snag slider on the other side. This makes it a lot easier to open and close the sleeping bag and it protects that material from any snags or any additional abrasion. So, it's just, again, added protection for the materials and added convenience for the user. The bag includes a stuff sack and a storage sack, so you get a lightweight stuff sack for backpacking or just packing it up for travel, and it is a fairly small stuff sack at that. You probably could compress it smaller, but you would need to purchase an accessory compression sack separately. And for storage, when you're keeping the bag at home, 
recommended not to store down in a compressed state. So Marmot includes a large oversized mesh bag for long-term storage. This is gonna keep it nice and loose, uncompressed, and easy to store at home. Overall, super lightweight sleeping bag, very packable and warm enough for those warm weather spring and summer adventures. It is the Marmot Atom 40 degree sleeping bag. Thanks for watching. If you have any additional questions about the gear that you just saw, feel free to visit backcountryedge.com to get in touch with me or one of our other gear specialists. We have detailed product descriptions and specs and often for a lot of our products, we have additional bonus videos. And if you like what we do here on YouTube, please subscribe.